I just finished a flying lesson and now I'm going to take you downstairs so I can show you how to make a stained glass stepping stone. I'm going to show you how to make a stained glass stepping stone. Tools that are needed are your glass, your pattern, we have safety glasses, and you'll need your cutter. Here's your pattern, your form, chicken wire, your clear contact paper, and you're going to be using cement and also a bucket of water and rags for cleanup. You'll put your pieces onto your pattern, then you take your contact paper, you put it like this, the sticky side, you'll get all your pieces. You've sprayed your form with your nonstick spray. You put this down here. Your concrete has been all mixed up. You take and you fill it half full. Then you take your piece of chicken wire. You lay that down in. That is for strength. Then you continue with your concrete. You fill that full. Then for about 20 minutes, you'll have to jiggle this. It's a very boring time, but you're going to want to do that to make all the air bubbles come to the surface. You can sleep on this 18 to 24 hours later. Your cement will be dry. You take it and you unmold it, you'll be taking off the clear contact paper. Then you've got your water and your rag here, and you're going to be wiping it all up and cleaning it up. And there you have your beautiful stepping stone. And that will last through the age of elegance. In Wisconsin, it snows, and we pack snowballs. A snowball of life packed with love, learning, healthy lifestyle, spirituality, and dreams. You throw these out. They may melt, but you still have it in your heart. And next year, you can pack a bigger snowball. Why do I want to represent Wisconsin in this pageant? I was born and raised and still live in Wisconsin. It gives us four great seasons. Spring, new beginnings, summer, warmth, growth, fall, harvest of color, and winter, our beautiful blanket of white snow. Last but not least, we cheer for the Green Bay Packers and the mighty Bucky Badger.